Going green is easier now if you live near a Walgreens. As hybrid cars accelerate to acceptance, companies are recognizing their dollar-saving potential at fuel stations. The Provo Walgreens has a special edition few people know about. I was curious. Greg stopped by to see the new fuel station. I saw, I just saw it driving in and uh, I, I didn't know really what it was until it looked like a gas pump. Kyle Hall helps manage the Provo Walgreens and he says local student housing would need to change to bring more gas electric vehicles into the neighborhood. I haven't seen a lot of people use it. I think part of that is just there aren't a whole lot of smart cars in the area that need to be charged because you have to have a place to plug them in at home and a lot of apartments aren't accommodating for that. Kyle says Walgreens executives actually use it the most when they come to visit. District managers and, and store managers and whatnot use uh, rented cars to drive around and go visit different stores. And this is a way for them to cut down on fuel costs so that they can come park the car here, charge it up while they're at the store, drive up to the next store, and then charge it where they need it. But a hybrid car isn't necessarily for everyone. Would you ever get a hybrid car now that you know oh, yeah, that this is here? I mean, it's, it's, If it's got the horsepower, maybe. <laughs> it would be more of a draw for me, I suppose, but I, I like my four-wheel drive pickup. <laughs> for the universe, I'm Casey Adams.